Welcome back to Let's Play Deadpool. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're here at a ridiculous party. <laughs> the, uh... I was starting to tell a story last time. Then I realized it required another story to explain it. Uh, I found out that the reason uh, Genosha is so built up as a, you know, a, an industrialized uh, nation is that there already was a country there before Magneto took over. In fact, it was, uh... Despite being such a tiny island, it was one of the richest nations in the world because they... Well, they did a test at birth, and any child that was born with the X gene was taken away from its parents, had all human rights stripped away, and became the property of the, of the state. Turns out your economy does really well when all of the mutants in your country are used as slave labor. So yeah, Genosha totally sucked before, uh, you know, the brief period of time when the mutants were considered people. That's kind of why, I guess, that Magneto chose that place for his nation. I didn't realize he had a sense of irony. The, uh... And let's face it, I'm pretty sure that is how you use that, because that is the opposite of what you'd expect. For Genosha to become a nation specifically dedicated to the, you know, well-being of mutants. Impress yourself today, says this lozenge. Hmm. Anyway, uh... Ultimate Deadpool. He has his own reality show, as I was starting to say. Except... That reality show is inside the old regime on Genosha, which still exists, or still existed over there at the time. And, uh... Oh, there's Psylocke. Yes, yeah, sorry, I got distracted <laughs> by something. Um, Ultimate Deadpool's reality show consists of him hunting mutants for sport on live TV. Oh, Domino, that was the, uh... Was that Arclight or Domino in the corner? Oh no, that is Domino, my mistake. You guys have already left comments about that avenue. Yeesh. But Vertigo definitely came back to life, because I shot her in the face and she never left that, uh, sewer. No one gets in if they're not on the list. Must be a short list. Rogue! Deadpool? What are you... Don't waste your time with her. Oh, daddy likes. Just wait, honey. I'm about to blow you away. What the hell? You mean this whole party was just in our head? Surprise! Huh? Sinister's got plans for you. Hey, let me go! Deadpool! It's payback time, you amazing son of a bitch! Ah! Where did all the fades go? They were never here. Yeah, I caught you. Do you know? Who the hell is that? Oh, she must be a clone of someone. For God's sake. Oh, there's two of you. Oh, gross. Holy Christ. Miss 
that. That? I couldn't hear you over the sound of you dying like a Keep child. Good, the backup has arrived. I was running out of action. Get ready to taste death. And it's one bitter kitten. And that made more sense in my head. I guess it's like, uh, that was as easy as, you know, fighting a child. Bullets! How convenient. Technically, those are called shells. Who are you supposed to be? Ow! Like I said last time, I'm pretty sure that's meant to be Havoc. Come on, die already! That's better. Oh. know who he's talking to. You'd better do it, he means it. My organs. See you in a minute. <laughs> Prison showers. There is no soap. A beautiful use of a beautiful. Problem solved. That won't work with these guys. Let's see the fucking hammers on them. Where did they go? All right. There we go. I had to trigger them by murdering that guy. They were demons hiding inside his mind. Enough of this! Here's my backside! That's what clean living and chimichangas can do for you! I'm gonna suck it! 
here, and we're good. Now I'm going to go upstairs and murder you. Isn't that exciting? Here comes the fuck train! <laughs> That's terrible. Barely even means anything. Just profanity for the sake of profanity. Connect that wire somehow. This is gonna hurt. These are surprisingly big and lavish showers for a prison. Oh, for God's sake. that from? I can say Jimmy Chaga in seven languages. You know, there's a, an X-Men arcade game from Japan where uh, they recorded all the, you know, quick voiceover blurbs in English, which means some of them aren't Given the era, some of them aren't translated very well. And, uh, when you get to the boss encounter, Magneto famously says, Welcome to die! I'm gonna get my finger ready on the, uh, old screenshot key. This is gonna hurt you more than it's gonna hurt me! Oh, oh, oh shit. Disbelief. All right. I don't trust guys with porno mustaches. How can you tell? Yeah, just checking. Oh yeah, I have a ton of points. Wise from your grave. <laughs> Speaking of uh, early voice acting in video games, that's a reference to uh, Altered Beast, a Sega Genesis uh, side-scrolling beat-em-up. Uh, there isn't much story to it. You're the this. I don't even remember why this girl needs to be saved, but this girl gets kidnapped, and fucking Zeus. Resurrects a uh, a dead you know, warrior of legend to go save her from the sorcerer who has kidnapped her, and uh, so the very first thing that happens in the game is lightning strikes a grave and you pop out of it, and you hear this really poorly digitized voice clip say "Rise from your grave," but uh, because it's you know really compressed, it sounds like "Rise from your grave."
Oh. Oh, shit. Kicks into the combo of up 20 every 10th strike. Can I? No, I cannot. Okay, yeah, you need, uh, that, that's the second one you need for, uh, the finishing move for the sword. If it bleeds, you can kill it. Hmm. Cuts combo is short because clones go bye bye. Hmm. That's actually a really clever tactic they mentioned there. Mind you, I still haven't gotten the fucking bear traps to work. Where do you suppose Blockbuster took Rogue? Maybe he's trying to make her fall in love with him! Would never work. His aftershave is repugnant. Yeah, you're right. He's probably just gonna torture her and kill her. She's not a bowl of Fruit Loops. Welcome to your doom. Right now I'm being stupid. Um... There it is. Ow. Delicious. Fuck, I was too quiet during that, uh, session in the store. Are we gonna get flagged for the stupid music again? Fucking store music, of all things. Bummer. Incidentally, I looked into it, and apparently the, uh... The Sentinels that destroyed Genosha were sent there by, uh, Cassandra Nova. And explaining who she is is both time-consuming and bizarre, so I'll just leave it at saying that she's, uh, Charles Xavier's evil twin. That was a death orgy of awesome right there. Death orgy of awesome sounds like a really bad action movie from the early 80s. Power. I'm Wade Wilson, and I approve this message. Generally pointed over there and... Congratulations, you got in close. So at first I thought I had to get those guys, uh, 
down to zero health, and then they'd show up again on the walls. But I think that was just a scripted sequence. Looks like diving into the floor is these guys, uh... Hello, Deadpool. Uh, death animation. I'm over here. Yeah, that's pretty much exactly what I thought. The whole point is to make them, these guys in particular seem more powerful. Well, we can use that next time, because the timer just went off. I'm Burning Dogface, and we'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Deadpool. Later.